Hey, welcome back to Car Snubs. This is my daily driver, a 2018 Mazda CX-5, which I've reviewed before. I'll put the link to check out the video for that. I've had it about three months now, and it's been, at least for Southern California, some of the roughest weather we've actually had. It's been raining almost every single day, and I feel like it's starting to take a toll on my seats. So I bought this. This is Jay Leno's Garage new products. And obviously, everyone knows that Jay Leno is a car guy, and he's got a ton of money, so I don't think he needs to just slap his name on any crap products. So I'm gonna put this on my seats, steering wheel, anywhere that is leather in this car. These are actual real leather seats. This is the Grand Touring package, so it is real leather. Uh, I'm gonna apply it on. You just gotta use a microfiber towel. You gotta dry for about five to 10 minutes, and then you rub it off with a clean towel. So let's take a look at how it does. All right, so here we go. You put a little bit of product on. And let's start on the steering wheel because the steering wheel needs some love too. Just massage it into there. And we'll come back. We'll let that dry, see how that looks. Let's do the seat while we're waiting. I already got a lot of stuff off of there. Let's see what the driver's seat looks like. Obviously the most used seat in the car. Looks like we're gonna use a lot of this. I thought it would have plenty of uses to this, but we might use the whole bottle on the car. Make sure to get into all the little grooves. That's the spots where it can really wear out and tear. So get all the stitching. Really rub the product into there. As you can see, we're already getting quite a bit of dirt out of there and that's only about half the seat. Get the headrest too, don't forget about that. And that should about do it for the driver's seat. I'm gonna do the rest of the car and then I'll catch up with you at the end. And here's the end result. So my driver's seat was obviously the worst one. I'm in and out of my car like 10 plus times a day and there was this kind of this stress fracture here. It cleaned it up pretty good. Um, back here, it looks really good. It's not overly shiny, which I like. I mean, a lot of these products will get super shiny. You can basically see a reflection in them and then you'll slide right off. And it's not that slippery either. I put it on the steering wheel. The last thing you want is your hand to slip on the steering wheel. It did a really nice job. I even did the inlays on the door panels here. There was some discoloring here. It actually got rid of quite a bit of that. And to the back seats, they look really good as they should because they are the least used out of anything in this car. But overall, I would recommend it. If you want to check it out, it did take about half the bottle. So I don't think you could really get more than two cleanings out of a bottle. Uh, for sure, at least clean your leather seats once or twice a year, just to keep them looking shiny and brand new. If you wanna check out the product, I'll leave a link to it in the comments. I don't get paid for this. This is purely just a test to see how it worked.